Hey everyone, welcome to 2014 and this year's first weekly roundup of news from the conservation world and the animal kingdom around the globe. First up, after an extensive study, Big Cat Conservation Group Panthera is calling for West African lions to be declared critically endangered. With only an estimated 250 adults still roaming just over 1% of their original range, their situation is more dire than previously thought. West African lions are considered genetically distinct, making the call to up conservation efforts urgent. Moving to Asia, where China has destroyed over six tons of confiscated ivory. Most of Africa's poached ivory ends up in China, contributing to the slaughter of about 25,000 elephants each year. The move is being applauded, but many conservationists are skeptical, saying that China can and should do more by banning the trade in ivory altogether. On a lighter note, well, probably not for the baby antelope being swallowed whole. This very cool video by rangers in Botswana shows an African rock python devouring its meal, a rare and amazing sight to see. Speaking of rare sightings, the discovery of the carcasses of a pair of conjoined gray whale twins discovered in a Mexican lagoon is perplexing scientists. They believe the mother may have miscarried and possibly died in the process as well. Interesting and tragic at the same time. Ever wanted to be Facebook friends with polar bears or manta rays? Well, now you can with a new app called Wild Me. The app not only lets you follow individual animals near you, but for their whole lives, like migrating whale sharks, for instance. It's exciting stuff. For more info about this app and the other stories in the Roundup, head over to our website at earthtouchnews.com. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter for updates. See you next week.